Hi folks. Now I've made a couple of videos talking about how to find backwards compatible games on the Xbox, but some people are still having a lot of problems. And if I'm being honest, it can be very hit and miss because the backwards compatible section of the store does have a tendency to disappear. And uh, I actually had the backwards compatible games up in the store earlier today, but they've actually disappeared for me now. So if we go into the store, if you look here, we've got Games Spotlight, or sorry, Home Spotlight. If we go down, let me see, where are we? Yeah, we want to be on Games, and if you do Show All, or if you go over to the side, you can go to Games and then Games Home, which does the same thing. So let's just go back again and do that again. Go to Games, Show All, or across to the left, and Games Home, and it brings you to the same place. Now, once you're in there, if backwards compatible games are showing up, they should be down the bottom. Now, they did show up for me earlier, right at the top, but they should be down the bottom. So let's see, are they there? No, they're not. So backwards compatible games have actually disappeared for me now, despite the fact that they were actually showing up earlier on. In fact, 10 minutes ago, they were up and I was trying to get rid of them so I could do this video. And so they finally disappeared. So if they disappear, what do you do? Well, I found what worked for me is if I go into search and then I do some searches for backwards compatible games, it sometimes comes back. So if I look for black, let's just do black. Black. We know that's a backwards compatible game. And we should find if we go down, black should show up. And there you go. So there's black and it says install or buy as a gift, so there's black. And we can go through and we can look about look at black. So you can find it from, for, from looking at it, but that's not what we want to do. We want to bring the, the menu up with these games on. So if I go back out of there again, if I go home and then I close the store and then I go back into the store and do a search again, let's do Crimson Skies. would choose one with a long name, wouldn't I? <laughs> there it is, Crimson Skies. So if we choose Crimson Skies, I can play with the cloud or I can install and uh, we can look up the game. It's a great game, by the way, this one, Crimson Skies. So then go back from there. Let's do another search. What shall I do? Time Splitters 2. Let's do Time Splitters 2. These are games that I remember. Time, ah, there you go, it's up there. We've got time splitters as well. So install or buy as a gift. We've got options there, no option for the cloud with that one. Another great game, great fun. So that's there. And uh, go out. Now, this is very hit and miss. So sometimes you'll find it will happen quicker than others, but it should come back. So now if I go to show all, and I go down to the bottom. Let's see if it's turned up yet. There you go, backwards compatible. It's not even at the bottom. Backwards compatible games are back and listed. So there you go. If you want backwards compatible games to show up in the store, what you're going to need to do is go and do a search for two or three games, go in and out of the store, and it should restore it. And uh, as I say, it's a bit hit and miss. But it does seem to be that this is contextual. So the more you look for backwards compatible games, the more likely they are to come up in the store menu. So yeah, if we go back out again and shut it down, go back in and let's just go across this time to store home and then go down and see if it's there this time. It's all over the place. Ah, actually, I haven't gone into, I've gone into store home. I haven't gone into games home. So let's just do that again. Games, games home. That's what we want. We want games home. So let's see, are backwards compatible games still there? Let's hope they are. And there they are. Slightly different place this time, I think, but they are there. So now we can go back into backwards compatible games at all. Uh, again, sorry. 
So yeah, that's um, that's one way of getting it back. So let me know how you get on with that. If uh, if you try this, let me know if you actually manage to get backwards compatible games showing up again in the store. Uh, if you do, if you don't, I'm quite happy to uh, <laughs> hear what you have to say. But that one does seem to work for me. Now I did it on my Xbox Series X, and I've just done it for you on my Xbox Series S. And I have tried it on an Xbox One X as well, and it's worked for all three. So hopefully that might help some of you out. And as I say, let me know in the comments how you get on with it. But for now, I'm going to disappear and get myself a cup of tea. And I will speak to you guys in the next one. Bye.